the dominant community other than Hind Jaisalmer are the Jains. They have beautified the city with beautiful temples. These temples are the must visit for all the tourists as they portray the talent of Rajasthani craftsmen and architectures. Madhava was the ancient capital of the Bharti Rajputs. This place is one of the important tourist spot. This is famous for the ruins of Jain temples. The most mesmerizing experience is the peacock dance. Peacocks are plenty in number here. Madhava is well known for its Jain temples which were made of bright yellow sandstones. You will find walls decorated with the pictures of Lord Pazvnath, the 23rd Jain Titanker. The beautiful Jaili works make these temples marvelous. Though in ruins, these Jain temples look splendid. The Pashvnath Temple The Pashvnath Temple is the main Jain temple here. It predates the others and was even destroyed once in 1152 but was reconstructed in 1615 by Sage Tharushar with further additions. Its Trinidwa or main archway is probably the most ornate of its kind in Rajasthan and interestingly the sentry outside is a Rajput, not a Jain. The ceilings of the Sabhaman Dapper support a demonic looking multi-hooded serpent canopy surrounded by five bodies. As you walk around the Mandapa the head seems to connect, in turn, with each of these in turn. The walls of the sanctum are carved with animal and human figures. The Shikara is crowned by an Amalak and a water pot containing a lotus flower Kalpevrishka celestial tree. Kalpevrishka tree is located inside the temple complex. This tree was made up of alloy of eight metals when the real tree died. It symbolizes enlightenment. There is a strong belief that any person who wishes anything with pure heart here gets fulfilled by the power of copper leaves of the tree. It is a saying that a black cobra lives in a carving of the outer wall of the temple for more than 400 years and it comes out only 10, 15 times during summer. Any person getting the glimpse of this serpent will be blessed with good luck.